the reason why I was asking, I was thinking maybe that's a violin that came from the nuns as well. No, not from the nuns. No. What no. did you learn when you were? I learned the piano from the nuns. Oh, how was that? Um, challenging. Why? And scary. Really? Yes. I thought you lose fear if you if you are religious. You lose the fear because you are saved by the savior. Well, they were, but not the pupil. Oh, really? Yeah. How come? Well, I, I thought they gave you all the blessings to be a happy person. Okay, I'll be the music teacher, you mm. be the student. Okay. You're sitting at the piano. Mm. Right? There was a lot of this going on. With their hands? Oh yes, yeah, smacking mm. the hands all to right. get them into position. Yeah. And if you didn't get the right position, you'd mm. often get a... It, it would crack even? Oh yes. Oh no. And their speciality was the long pencil that had a clown's head on the end. They were long and they could reach over and write on the music with them. <laughs> but when they wished to torture you or punish you, mm. they would turn the pencil around till you had the clown's head on the end. And that would be? The, uh, yes, that would be the object of abuse. We'll go on and that. then if there was a duet, mm. that was even better because mm. you could lean over and whack both people. <laughs> What does it indicate when you are whacked on your hand? What did it indicate you're doing wrong? Well, no one really knew because it depended on what sort of mood they were in. I see. So anything that got under their skin would warrant a good slap. But, but you didn't do anything to them, no? Oh, yes. I mean, you no, played no, the you, piano. Yes, you might. Like, well, keeping in time for a duet. Yeah. Keeping in t yeah, tempo full stop was mm. the thing that upset them the most. Yeah. But often for tempo, you would get this. On your shoulder. Yes, and if it wasn't good, you'd get it heavier and heavier. Mm. But the best one was this with the back of the hand, mm. where they'd get around the back and actually punch you in between the shoulder blades. Really? With a, with yeah. A, okay. It was correction. Oh. You would be trying your best because no one wanted to get a whack. Or a punch. Yes, yes. So you would try to behave out of fear. Hey? Yeah, and it would be held in the hand as an object of threat. It mm. was sort of threatened mm. you, you mm. see. I think it's quite fortunate that, that uh, you know, we are beyond those times these days. I think it's totally fortunate. Yeah. yeah, because music, of course, isn't meant to be uh, something to be afraid of, you know. And when you go into the lesson and and you're afraid all the time that you do things wrong. What kind of relationship That's do you right. develop towards That's music? Right. Fear. So fear. It's always fear. Yeah. And do you did you sort of keep going to play the piano later on? Oh, well, the parent, your parents in those days believed that you deserved it. <laughs> that that you deserved what? Correction. Really. Physical correction. Oh, your parents knew about it. Oh yes. Hmm. Yes, we. But you got to the stage where you would never go up and tell your parents. Yeah. Because you wouldn't get a positive response. Yes, you were it very was, obedient. You must have been doing the wrong thing. Hmm. So that's why they got away with everything that they did. Yeah, yeah. With the physical abuse. In yeah. school it used to be the ruler. Hmm. Big long rulers. You'd always get hit in school. Hmm. So it was, it was pretty well fear. Hmm. And also everything, we had Saturday school for music hmm. and speech. And um, you would go on Saturday mornings, and that gave them, because they had all the time in the world, they just kept you there. On Saturday yes, mornings? Yes, because we had practice rooms. So if they felt you hadn't done enough practice, after your lesson you'd be sent to the practice rooms for a couple of hours, where you'd be checked up on too. For two hours? Easily. Hmm. Yeah. So you, you didn't like practicing? Well, not, not, with, for two hours. Not, not with them walking around uh -huh. um, uh -huh. on terrible pianos. The mm. practice pianos were dreadful. Mm. Some of them had uh, mute notes. I mean, it was dreadful. Yeah, yeah, but so, they didn't punish you for those uh, keys, of course. That was just the way it was. That's how they were, yeah. yeah. But they had perfect pianos. The pianos were always tuned, almost weekly. Oh. They were very dedicated. The ones that they played on. Oh yes, that we had for lessons were beautiful. Ah, just the practicing pianos. Yeah, the practicing like. pianos were dreadful. So mm. you wouldn't want to be in trouble, because to practice on them was terrible too. Yeah, yeah. So it was a way of correcting, like making everyone do things. But isn't it interesting, because these nuns, obviously, 
were trying to do that also. So mm -hmm. nobody told them it's not the right thing. No, they may have been taught the same yeah, way. Yeah, and they may have been treated the same way when they were little. That's right. And these days, probably the, all those things are considered illegal even. Yes, but when, when I get together with my friends, and mm. we all went to the same school, but we all had different music teachers, mm. all the music teachers did it. Yeah. There was not sort of a really kind one or one that was better than the other. It was mm. a couple that were a bit crueler than the others. Yeah. And meaner. <laughs> but uh, no, we never had any of the music te mm. teachers at school yeah. were lovely. Thank you very much for sharing the story. As My I said, I'm, I'm glad that, that these times are over. And um, I believe that by treating students differently, yeah. the success rate is not lower. No. <laughs> no. If the success was depending on fear, yeah. You would have at least one argument for it. Yeah, but it's not the message of Jesus, is it? If there's any message. Well, it means love your neighbor. No, <laughs> I went to school before the Jesus thing. We had God the Father. I see. And it was terror and fear. We I weren't see. brought up with God is love. I see. That happened probably in the 60s. Is that true? Yeah, see, I'm so ignorant in terms of this historic sequence of things. But that would explain some... Oh, it did. It really did. Okay. Thank you very much again. It was quite uh, interesting. <laughs> it's an, an opportunity for, for all potential teachers to learn how not to do it. That's right. Okay. Thank you very much. Bye. <laughs>